So your competitors are killing you on the search results. What can you do? Well, it won't be easy and it won't happen overnight, but if you can pinpoint all of the places they're outranking you, you can chip away at their traffic slowly but surely. The basic strategy is simple. The most important thing is finding all the keywords that your competitors rank for that you don't. Once you have a list of these keywords, you can start picking out their best targets to go after with SEO or PPC, but it all starts with the competitive research. In this video, I'll show you how to find all the keywords your competitors are beating you out for and identify the easiest ones to start stealing your competitors' traffic. For example, let's say we run a competitive travel website. I'll pick kayak.com. If I'm Kayak, I would want to know how I can steal traffic from competing websites like TripAdvisor and Expedia. So I log on to SEMrush and fire up the Domain vs. Domain tool. To get there, I open the Domain Analytics section from the menu on the left and go down to where it says Domain vs. Domain. Here I can choose Advanced Mode, which is a feature that lets you switch between looking at paid or organic keywords and various relationships between them. We'll choose Organic and Common Keywords shared between each domain. After typing in the domains and hitting go, we get a table of the top keywords that all three sites are ranking for somewhere in Google's top 100 results. Every keyword is listed here along with the website's rankings. But I want to know which keywords my competitors are getting traffic from that I'm not. So what we can do is go ahead and add filters for keywords where Expedia and TripAdvisor rank on the first page of Google and Kayak does not. Now we have a huge list of all the keywords where my competitors are ranking on the first page of Google, but my website is nowhere to be found. This list will act as my roadmap of where I can start pickpocketing some of their traffic. We can use the same filters to find the mobile keywords that my competitors are beating me on in case I need to improve my mobile strategy too. If I hit enable charts, we get a nice visual of each website's keyword portfolio and their overlap. The Venn diagram shows you how much of the search market your competitors get traffic from that you're missing out on. We can see here that TripAdvisor kind of blows Kayak and Expedia out of the water when it comes to the size of their keyword portfolios. With a comparison like this, it's easy to see how much work you've cut out for yourself and how much room there is to improve. As a side note, this visual makes a great chart to share with SEO or PPC prospects because you can show them how much room there is for improvement. What I'll do now is export the data to a spreadsheet to share with my SEO or marketing team. To avoid getting cross-eyed staring at a huge list of keywords, you'll want to prioritize the keywords that are easiest to go after first. The best way to do that is by sorting with the SEMrush's keyword difficulty metric. The KD column tells you how hard it would be to outrank the websites currently ranking on the first page. So in this case, how hard it would be to join your competitors and potentially outrank them on the first page of the results. The lower the keyword difficulty score, the better chance you have at being able to rank quickly for the search. So I'll sort this list by ascending keyword difficulty and we'll end up looking at the most targetable keywords where I can start taking traffic from my competitors. But how can I use this list of keywords to get more traffic? Well, there are a few options. I can build better content on my site to boost my SEO for these keywords. This means focusing on your on-page SEO elements to line up with your target keyword and acquiring authoritative links. Maybe I need to clean up my on-site SEO to really focus on these keywords. Or maybe I need to build out more content. In SEMrush, there's a tool called the SEO Content Template, and if I just enter a keyword I want to rank for, it gives me a template with suggestions how to make a piece of content to outrank the current ranking pages. Another way to steal some traffic is to set up a pay-per-click campaign to direct searchers away from my competitors' organic results and towards my paid ads. If you want to plan a PPC campaign to target a group of keywords, we have a tool for that. It's called the PPC Keyword Tool and it's under your project section. This tool lets you plan entire campaigns and ad groups around a set of keywords and negatives that can be exported and uploaded directly into an AdWords account. In conclusion, having a comprehensive list of keywords where your competitors are beating you 
can do a lot for your marketing efforts. It acts as an excellent source of search market research and can function as your roadmap towards growth. Remember, when starting a new digital marketing campaign, it's crucial to evaluate your competitors in order to see where you all stand. And that's what makes SEMrush the perfect place to start.